Hi children, welcome back. Today we are going to discuss the concept of tens and ones from the number 11 to 20. Yesterday we have completed up to 10 children. Now in that what we have learned? That a set of 10 sticks or anything that is 10, when they are made into a set or a group, it is called a group of 10 or a bundle of 10. Okay? Now in this 10, in this set of 10, if I am adding one more stick, what does it become children? It becomes 11. Yes, 10 plus 1 is 11. So now this number 11, 1, 1. How do we write? 1, 1 is 11. How this 11 is made children? Using one set of 10. So how many 10s I have? One set of 10s I have. 1 10s and 1 1s. And 1 1s. This makes 11. One set of 10 and a single stick. This makes 11. So how I will write this? In the 10s place I will write 1 because I have 1 10s. And 1 1s. A single one I have 1. So 1 1s. So in the tens place also I have 1 and in the ones place also I have 1. Okay children? Now in this if I am adding one more stick children. Okay? So I have a set of 10 and I have two single sticks. So this is one tens and two ones. One ten and two ones. So 10 and 2 are 12. Okay? 10, 11, 12. So the number 12. How is this number 12 formed children? By one set of 10. So I have 1 tens. And how many ones I have? I have 2 ones. Okay children? I hope the concept is clear to you. Now children I am adding one more stick in this. Okay? So now I have a bundle of 10. And 3 single sticks. So how much it makes? 10, 11, 12 and 13. So now 13. How is this 13 number made? By 1 set of 10. I have 1 set of 10. And 3 single sticks. So 3 ones. So 1 tens and 3 ones is 13. So I will write 1 tens and 3 ones. Now in this 13 I am going to add one more stick children. So now I have 10 and 4 single sticks. So this makes 14 sticks. 10 and 4 is 14. So I will write 14. Now how is this number made? It is made by 1 set of 10s. I have one set of 10 and 1, 2, 3, 4, 4 ones. So, in, I have one tens and 4 ones. Okay? Now I am taking one more stick. Now this makes 10 and 5 single sticks. So this makes 15. Okay? 10 and 5 is 15. So, 15 is made by 1 group of 10 and 5 single sticks, 5 ones. So, 15 is made up of 1 tens and 5 ones. Okay, children? Now, I am adding one more stick to this. Okay? Now, I have 1 set of 10 and 6 single sticks. Okay, this makes 10 and 6 is 16 children. Okay, so I will write 16. Now how is the 16 made children? Using 1 tens and 6 ones. This makes the number 16. Now I am adding one more stick. This makes 7 sticks and a bundle of 10. So this bun so this is total 17. Now 17 number is formed by 1 tens and 7 ones because I have 7 single sticks. Okay children? 
Now I am adding one more stick. So this makes a group of 10 and 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. 8 sticks I have total. So 10 and 8 is 18. So I write 18. Now how is this 18 made children? Using a group of 10. 1 tens and how many 1's children? These are 8 sticks. So 8 1's. Okay? 1 tens and 8 1's. It makes 18. Now I am adding one more stick children. So this becomes 9 sticks, 9 single sticks and a set of 10. And a set of 10. So it becomes 19. Now 19 number is formed by 1 set of 10 and 9 single sticks. So it is 1 tens and 9 ones. This makes the number 19. Now I add one more stick children. This makes a group of 10. Now I have bundled these 10 sticks into one single bundle. Okay. Now I have two bundles of 10 each. So I have two sets of 10 children. Two sets of 10 makes 20. 20. There are total 20 sticks children. 10 in this and 10 in this. So two sets of 10 makes 20. So I have two tens. And do I have any single stick children? No. So zero ones. Two tens. Two tens and zero ones makes the number 20. See I have two sets of tens and they are total 20 sticks. Okay children, I hope the concept of tens and ones is clear to you. You can practice them using these sticks or any sketch pens like that. Okay. Bye children.